And the last of our G-Stock competitor, your event chair, Sam Karp, number 198 in his 2006 Honda Civic. I think we all need to give Sam a big, big thank when we, thanks when we see him. We're here this afternoon with Sam Karp. He's the event organizer of the Tire Rack Milwaukee National Tour, part of the SCCA Milwaukee region. Uh, Sam, it's been a great event so far today. Let's talk about just how many different entrants there are, how many cars, drivers, and uh, how many different classes we're running. Uh, we're at right about 250 drivers for this event right now, uh, spread apart four different heats, covering about uh, 60 different classes overall in the SCCA competition. Now, this is part of the national tour for the SCCA leading up to the national championships. Uh, what kind of time commitments do these drivers have to make traveling to different events around the country? Oh, we have drivers traveling as far as uh, from New York to California, 2,500 miles one way, driving literally three or four days straight just to get one place and then have to drive back the next day. It's a, it's a lot of time involved for all these drivers, three days, four days at the event, plus all their travel time as well. Along with time commitments as well, everybody that's out here helping out with the event as far as safety crews, making sure that everything is okay on the course, uh, to timing all of that, th these are all volunteers, correct? That is correct. Everybody that uh, participants participates in these events has to work the event. They are all volunteers. Unlike other forms of motorsports where the entrants just drive, also our entrants work the event. Without them working the event, these events would not be possible. Now, your involvement with this as the event organizer, how long does it take for you to get an event like this, a two-day event here at Miller Park, put together? Uh, the planning for this event actually started back in October. And every single month, uh, little by little, it all comes together. Obviously, the big crunch time is within the, uh, about two weeks before the event is when the big crunch time comes down, almost three, four hours a day dedicated just to putting this event together. And in addition to being the event organizer, you're also one of the drivers. Tell us a little bit about the class and the car that you're going to be driving in. That's right. I drive a, a G-Stock uh, 2006 Honda Civic Si, uh, pretty much a stock class, one of the, the slowest of the stock classes, but very difficult to drive. All right. Well, thank you very much for taking time out. It's been a great event. This has been Sam Karp, the event organizer of the Tire Rack Milwaukee National Tour. Well, some great insight there from the event organizer, Sam Karp. Sam is a hard working guy, he really has done a great job, brought their pro our program to the next level. Uh, we couldn't do an event like this without someone with Sam's dedication. It's very apparent he has done a great job at putting things together. And speaking of putting things together, we're going to take a look at some other stuff being put together on the track. We'll get to see a few more of the classes, a couple more examples, uh, some stock classes, some uh, street modified classes, and I think you'll enjoy uh, seeing the different kinds of cars and different modifications that people have done to their cars. Hi, my name's Todd Lorino. I drive this Camaro. It's 1998 Camaro 1 LE, one of 99 built. It's number 58. This is my daughter's birthday. And uh, I've been driving this car since I started autocrossing uh, 15 years ago, and I've been at every single autocross ever since. So I'm one of the, uh, the old guys now, and uh, we're out here to try to give these young guys a run for their money. 89 Jim Harn, uh, Des Plaines, Illinois. Jim through the light, 64006. Hi, I'm Jim Harn. I'm with the SECA Chicago region. I'm also a dual member. I have a, a Milwaukee membership. I'm running uh, H-Stock today at the Milwaukee National Tour. This is uh, my car, a 2005 Mini Cooper, running number 89 H-Stock. My co-driver is Stephen Kettlestrings in 189. I'm out of Des Plaines, Illinois, and we're here uh, having some fun. And I'm running Kumo tires today, and along with uh, the Mini USA contingency program. So uh, hope you'll join us. Enjoy. All right, this is Dee Padberg through the lights in our quickest run so far in CP, 60977, 60.977. My name is Desiree Padberg, and I drive a, a 1988 Ford Mustang in C Prepared at um, the Solo Nationals. Um, last year I was the 2006 C Prepared Ladies National Champion. The car has an Honest 302 under the hood, and it has approximately 524 horsepower. Oh, and my husband is also runs the car. <laughs> All right, here comes Eric Stemmler driving the Pontiac GXP Solstice. Hi, I'm Eric Stemmler from Peoria, Illinois, and I'm uh, racing an A-Stock competition this weekend. My car is a 2007 Pontiac Solstice GXP, 
It's uh, basically stock with uh, Hoosier racing tires and Moton uh, racing suspension. Other than that, it's just as you could buy it off the showroom floor. Hello, my name is Bob Clark. I'm from Glendale, Wisconsin. I drive this 2002 BMW 330Ci in D-Stock and Solo 2. Uh, D-Stock allows you to run sticky tires, a uh, front sway bar, and some better shocks. And that's what I have on this car, and I've been doing it for about 25, 30 years. I lose count. We're going to take a short break. When we come back, we're going to introduce to you the Barr family, yet another one of the SCCA racing families here at the Milwaukee region. I'm Tom Sutton, and I want you to join me on Time Warner Sports for Midwest Classic Golf, the half-hour show that tells you the point of destination golfer, where to play, where to stay, and where to have fun. I'll show you the best courses in the Midwest. We'll even take you over to Scotland. I'll challenge the toughest holes on the toughest courses. Tree-line courses? Got them. You like them length style? Look at this. Midwest Classic Golf on Time Warner. Welcome back to the SCCA Milwaukee National Tour put on by Tire Rack. I'm John Kurzawa, joined by Tony Maki. We're here at Miller Park. And now we're going to take a look at yet another one of the families here at the SCCA, the Barr family. Dale and Mary and their uh, daughter, Ann, have been uh, racing uh, with SCCA for a few years now. They're very active. They've, it's truly a family ex, uh, expedition for them. They come all the way from uh, the northwest uh, corner of the state, travel a long way to get here. Time to introduce you to the Barr family. We're here with the Barr racing family, Dale, Mary, and Ann. Uh, Dale, why don't you tell us about how your family became a racing family? Well, we've always enjoyed cars, and uh, Mary and I had some work with cars we've done before, and the autocrossing was just a natural progression with that, and then we got involved at the higher levels, and then we wanted something to do with Ann. And uh, they have the FJ program for the kids with the cars, and it works out great. They come to the events, and they've got a sport, too, and they run the same course as we do, and it works out real good. Mary, we know about the time commitments that some of the single drivers that only have one driver in their group have to undertake, but having three, how much more of a time commitment is there for your family? It's a big time commitment, uh, especially for Dale. He has to prep a, a car for two drivers and also make sure that the cart's ready. Oftentimes we're running the same heat, so we're racing between trying to see Anne Marie out on course, race back to our car and hop and go. And Dale has to be prepared to air the tires and get everything ready for the race. And uh, there's a lot of car prep so it's it's a big time commitment but we're all geared toward it and, and we have such a fun time with it that uh, we're real committed and Anne, with you and the formula juniors uh, who do you follow in the footsteps more of your father or your mom who was a 2005 STU champion my dad <laughs> so you're saying you, you don't want to be a champion or dad is more of a role model for you dad's more of a role model <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to put you on the spot there with that question. This is the Barr family. Wish them best of luck in their racing and the events today. Welcome back. That was a great look at the Barr family of racing, but now we're going to take a look at some other racing out on the course, Tony. We'll get to the third heat in A stock, and we'll show you who uh, pulls off the win today. Okay, back into A stock actions, beginning with second rounds. Your current leader, Joel Farper, the 59.230. Followed uh, very closely by Matt Braun and by Marsha Moore. This is looking uh, just like Superstock, just about less than one-tenth of a second, blanketing the first three spots. Gregory Lukacs is our first finisher in A-Stock here in second runs. Okay, I'm, I'm Greg Lukacs from Muhammad, Illinois. That's down near Champaign. Uh, I'm racing an A-stock in the 96 Corvette here. It's a Grand Sport. These are fairly rare. This is uh, car number 447 out of uh, 1,000, so uh, a little bit rare. And uh, just good, having a good time here. Welcome back. That was a great look at some more A-stock action. But, Tony, we're going to go ahead and take a look at some more action on the course. Yeah, we're going to get to see some more stock automobiles like you drive to work every day, but more, but more excitingly, we'll get to see the mod cars run. We'll get to see the C-modified and the E-modified cars. These cars are uh, highly modified uh, stock automobiles, and it, it, they'll be exciting to watch.
Hi, my name is Lucas Anderson. I'm from Oak Creek, Wisconsin. I drive an FP car for Sports Car Club of America. It's a Datsun 240Z 1972. It's prepared. Got a bottom half of a 280, top half of a 240Z, and fuel, fuel injected. And uh, we have a lot of fun driving this thing, me and Andy Kanick. We have a whole gaggle of minis out there. There's one VW and one Honda in this class, and the rest are all minis. And coming through is one of the Hondas. Hi, my name's Mike Maki. I run G-Stock. I'm from Milwaukee. Uh, G-Stock is medium horsepower, front-wheel drive cars. Most of them, there are some all-wheel drives and rear-wheel drive cars. But uh, the big car in our class right now is a Mini Cooper. I'm running an underdog, so um, it's my wife's car. I get to drive it on weekends and holidays, as I say. It's her daily driver. I get to drive it on the weekends. Um, I don't know what's going to happen in the class next year. They may move some cars. They may not. I hope they move the Mini Coopers. And then it'll be a whole new ball game in our class. Wow. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> I'm Don O'Doy. I work for the Bloomingdale Police Department, and I'm driving Pat Polis's C-Mod car, because mine doesn't work right now. Um, actually, this is a lot of fun because of the fact that I'm a police officer, so it relieves some of the stress from work, and I encourage any kids to legally race to do this. They become much better drivers. Welcome back. It's been a great day here at Miller Park with the SCCA Tire Rack Milwaukee Nationals, and it's uh, just a great event with all the different classes we've seen. But, Tony, let's take a look at the A-Stock division, which we've really been following. Yeah, at A stock, it was really a, a close battle today. Uh, Jason Collett pulled out the uh, victory with a uh, 57 387 run, uh, 0.47 seconds faster than Steve Winbreen, who wound up in second place. Steve, by the way, was the course designer, so maybe that gave him an edge today. Uh, I don't know about that. We're not going to go in that direction. Well, thank you very much for joining us today here from Miller Park. Again, it was the SCCA Tire Rack Milwaukee National Tour. On behalf of Tony Maki, I'm John Kurazawa. And don't go anywhere. We've got something exciting for you right now.